What's up guys, Techmas here, your source for tech. Today I'm going to be talking about Firefox and the Firefox challenge that I present to viewers. Essentially, I've been using Firefox since, I want to say, at least before 2005. And I have been a fan of Firefox, but up until, I don't know, let's say 2010, 2011, 2012... It really bugged down, and I actually started using Google Chrome right here. But lately I've been noticing, and it's probably been like this for a while, is that, is that Google Chrome essentially takes up a lot of memory. And I'm not going to start it because it overloads my memory itself. I've got 8 gigs of memory, but it takes up like almost half of it. It's insane how much memory it actually takes up. Now, Firefox is a little bit lighter on the memory. Now, the main reason why I switched to Google Chrome from Firefox, even though I was using it that long, was because it had trouble with a lot of flash pages, flash rendering, games wouldn't look as nice. Uh, if you know about Bejeweled Blitz, that would look horrible. But now I've upgraded and I'm on a beta version of Firefox, actually. That's Firefox 12, I believe. And essentially, it actually is very fast. So runs very fast I'm able to get to web pages pretty fast and it's different though from the version that we're all used to it's more like Chrome in the fact that it has the tabs on top I believe you can reconfigure this I will be doing a full-on review of this and we'll look at reconfiguring it to make it look like the old Firefox but that's essentially my challenge to you is if you're a Chrome user and you like Chrome and you're using it for a while, I challenge you to try to go back to Firefox and to give it one last chance, if you will, to try to be a good browser. I believe that maybe in the future Firefox will be getting better, and I've already noticed some things getting better as far as speed and performance, but personally, when I was using it in the past, I've had problems. Now it seems like with a lot of updates coming back and forth, it seems like a good browser to keep trying. So... That's the challenge, guys, and if you can accept this challenge, uh, put a link, or uh, sh I should say, put a comment, not a link, in the comments page below and tell me if you're interested in doing this challenge. And I'm going to try to do, I don't know, let's say a month of using Firefox as my primary browser, mainly on Windows. I actually am a fan of Chrome on the Mac platform, but that's a different story. But on Windows, if you're on Windows, try to use Firefox as your primary browser for a week or something like that. For me, I'm going to do it a month, give you guys a review back on it and how it went. And essentially, you guys should try to do this as well. So that's pretty much it for today, guys. I'm going to be doing a couple other videos of iPad, the new iPad review that's coming up once I can get the cash to get a decent tripod for the iPhone. If anybody knows of a decent tripod, please let me know in the comments link below. And if you like my channel, like everything I do, definitely subscribe and like this video. And if you're interested in doing this challenge, like this video as well. So thank you guys for watching, and I hope you take that challenge. Thank you again for watching Techmas, your source for tech.